Oh, Christ, 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 Christ. Get back up to the court. It was at this moment that he knew. my co-highs hope you're all doing well i'm your host Torano senpai and welcome to a special episode of path of titans we have finally finally hit 2k on the channel 2000 subscribers and oh my god i didn't think i'd actually get this far like it was already crazy to already get a thousand subscribers but 2000 that that's crazy that you guys want to watch my that, that many people want to watch my content. Yeah, hey, I can't speak. As a special treat, I have decided to play on a community server. Uh, yeah, I finally broke. Um, this is what finally got me to do it. But we are not alone. We are joined by Urban Moon. Hello. We're playing obviously as the Tyrannosaurus, but we're not playing as the vanilla T Rex. We're actually playing as the Primordial Tyrant T-Rex, which, I must say, looks so much better. Look at that baby model! That is so cute! Aww. I am um, at the Hoodoo Expanse. Oh my oh. god. It's okay, I think I can cross now. We could yeah, probably oh waystone- god. we could waystone each other if that's a possibility. Uh, no, this is realism, we can't use the waystones on this one. What, are you kidding? Serious? Yeah. Well, oh, oh, okay. You can see my name, apparently, yeah, correct? Yeah, I can. Okay, I'm gonna switch leadership to you so I can see your name and get to your location. Alright. You are now the group leader. I am heading your way as quickly as I can. So what you've done, basically, is just shifted all responsibility to me. Nah, there's no responsibility. The only thing that will change now is our local POI quests will be based on your location rather than mine. Oh my god, look at that growth. I haven't done any quests yet, and look at that. I know, it's so much easier. And to think, All right. in 20 plus years, he will be a menace. <laughs> More like three hours if we manage to get these quests done without being murderized by all the other things wanting to kill off the... You know, yeah, the because uh, if there's anything I've learned from the Isle, when you play as a T-Rex, you're basically got a target on your back. Oh, absolutely. You're basically the biggest, uh, baddest thing in the ecosystem. But luckily for me, I perfected the method of run and hide. <laughs> also, did you hear about the fact that they're adding aggressive uh, AI critters to the game? I did. I was on the PTB branch when uh, we were working on it, and I had myself a grand old time watching adult tyrannosaurs running away from little frogs. Oh my god, are you serious? I am very serious. They set the AI so it wouldn't attack anything that's heavier than a strictly, but uh, it managed to mess up and it attacks every little thing it can, and it'll track you down over miles too, until it eventually despawns. That is hilarious. Uh, it reminds me of when the Omniraptor AI was added to the Isle in Avrima for a while, and they turned every single AI, Utah Raptor, or sorry, Omniraptor, into John Wick. It would follow you across the map, no matter where you went, sprinting oh. built after you. Oh, that's horrible. Yeah, I experienced it. It was uh, shortly after they released the Pteranodon, and I was flying halfway across the map, and I sat down for like five minutes to regain my stamina. And all of a sudden, I hear this rapid approaching footsteps, and I just get lunged at. I'm <laughs> like, where did that guy come from? And then I realized after I died, seeing it just spiral around in place, it was like, was that the same AI that I attacked earlier? Oh, that's hysterical. Oh, yeah, uh, I should Rex. mention, I should mention to the viewers, Urban Moon did have a hand in making this T Rex mod. I just had a hand in uh, suggesting things and was a paleo cost. I no longer have quests to do here. So I think I'm going to hide in a bush, see how many marks I got, and pick which abilities I want. Okay, so what does skin cost for tigers? Oh, it's actually a thousand. I can get that now, actually. But cosmetics are secondary to me. 
Yeah, okay. do yourself a favor and make sure to get yourself some abilities first. Right. Crushing bites. Okay, we'll have that, but I can't use it just yet. Senses. Uh, go ambush. Do yourself, do yourself a favor, switch to ambush because that is key with Tyrannosaurus. Oh, I can't I can't get it yet. I need a thousand and I just spent seven Bring seven hundred. So I gotta wait oh. a minute. Oh wait, hold on. Uh knockback resist, bone break, or attack. Uh, attack is the best one. I can genuinely say that now. Okay. <laughs> Urban, what is this crouch walk? This is super floaty. It's because it's small at the moment. As an adult, it's much better. Urban! I see you! Howdy. Oh my god, why are you so big? I did quests. Holy shit, you are massive! <laughs> this is just the beginning of Juby stage. This is just outside of the first bar. Oh! Oh! I'm still a baba! Anyway, I'm gonna collect these tiger nuts so I can catch up to you. I've got a quick uh, thing for a roots quest, but I am more than okay to move on from here. I mean, you can get roots if you want to. Besides, yeah, I just yeah. got a thousand marks, so I'm definitely gonna get the ambush ability. Alright, all I gotta do is go get some roots. This shouldn't take too long. If I tell you to run, it's probably because I'm about to die. <laughs> well, I'm not letting you out of my sight. Big footsteps, by the way. Ah, son of a bitch. I'll get out no of the open. I have no idea which direction those footsteps are coming from, but I can hear them on my right. Well, this doesn't look very conspicuous, does it? Also, I'm I need to turn off music because this is gonna kill my editing. We need uh we need dinosaur graveyard. That's what we need. So where should we go from here? Uh, I was assuming that we could either go over to uh, Birchwood area, which is a really good growth area for Rexes. You know what? Yeah, let's go there. I also am kind of thirsty. Yeah, we can find some uh, water here shortly. I believe there's a river pretty close to us that we can drink from. Yeah, it's right it's here. Either, yeah, it's either this river or the river next over. Also, while I'm here, I wanted to give a brief shout out to our good friend Kyle or Dwoop333. Um, he is another small creator, uh, and he's also a very good friend of mine who's been on the channel a couple times. Uh, our latest video that we did together is up on his channel. Um, if you want a good laugh, I'll leave a little snippet here, just as a taste. But go watch the actual thing itself, because we actually had a fun time. We were playing Lethal Company. Drunk. Oh god, I haven't had a chance to play that game yet. Oh, it's hilarious. I have, it, I have heard that it is good. It is hilarious, especially after you've had a few. Although I will say, a couple of the, of the decisions I made while under, you know, intoxication, probably not the best choices I have ever made in my life. So. I remember you saying, like, you were here for... You lived in America for a couple of years. I did. Any particular singers you like from America? Oh, God. Oh, there's this one country singer. That yes. I started to like recently. Uh, he, the, he did the song God's Country. Blake Shelton. That's it. That, that song. Woo. Yeah, it's, it. it's alright, but that song for me has been overplayed to death. That is... Like, there, uh, there comes a song, there comes a point when a song goes from, oh, it's really catchy, I like this, to being overplayed to death. That's one of them. And that's why I don't listen to the radio anymore, because it's just, oh, It just feels so samey all the time. There is also, uh, Kansas, the band. Uh, did, uh, Carry On Wayward Son. I have a thing for them, too. Carry on my wayward son. Oh my god, you just brought back a me You just brought back Super a core memory. Uh, Supernatural has no, uh, no, absolutely no, uh, sway on that whatsoever. <laughs> so, um, my, when I used to work in the restaurant industry, I was, a, I was a dishwasher, and, and I think my boss was singing the chorus to Carry On My Wayward Son. 
and me and my uh, co-worker started joining in. Don't you just love it? Like when someone starts bursting into song and you just sing with them? I used to work at a bar by the name of Weatherspoons when I came back to the UK. Ah. And uh, on our clothes in the evenings, uh, we would sometimes play radio through the speaker system or songs from our Spotify collections. Right. And God, my list, uh, you could take it straight from the 80s or the 90s and Wayward Sun was always on there and in the evenings when we were shutting down wiping tables bringing everything in they would always hear me belting it out from the father's room and all I would hear is shut the hell up that's hysterical it was either that or uh, Wagon Wheel by Darius Rucker I was in art class one time because I took that when I was in high school and oh, randomly Randomly, I started singing The Gambler. Oh, God. Every <laughs> single one of my uh, classmates started singing with me. Uh, Gambler, Coward of the County, and... Uh, oh, what's the other one? I don't... I don't know. Jolene. Jolene, ah. Huh. Yeah, there's just something about classic country that gives me the good feels. Yeah, classic but... country and... Uh, oh, jazzy country are my favorite. Rock Country is also amazing, but it's rare that you find any of that now. Yeah. Oh god. For me, the big fun. one from my from my younger year, years was Randy Travis. Tell you one thing that I uh, discovered recently that I never thought I would actually enjoy. Uh, and take this in mind, I'm not Christian whatsoever, but um, Christian rock Christian. has been something in yeah. Christian rock has been something in interesting. I've never heard it pronounced Christian. I've only heard Christian. Uh, I think that's because I'm British and we pronounce everything in a weird way. Oh, by the way, in case you don't know, if you get latched by the ramp rings or anything like that, you can just tap space to buck them off. I'm not sure if you knew that or not. I knew that. But what are they going to do to us? They can't do jack. Oh, no, but they can be very annoying. Yeah, but, you know, I'd be that type of dude. Yeah, I, I usually don't mind them, unless they're screaming constantly or using that ability while in their groups to make you scream while you're on the hunt. Oh yeah, that that is bothersome. I like how wiggly our tail is. I mean, look at that. It's like a spaghetti noodle. Oh wait, no, I gotta do the meme. Spaghetti noodle! Oh my god. Spaghetti noodle, yeah! Have you ever seen the simulation that was made for Victoria, the T-Rex? No, one of their new I'm games? afraid not. Okay, well, uh, the T-Rex holds its mouth open, flashes it, and hisses at you while, uh, posturing. Oh, that sounds and beautiful. You know it what I'd like to see? Really like, um, I, I saw this one clip, I don't know where it was, but it was clearly a very poor quality video from someone recording a screen. And I had two T-Rex, um, fighting, and the camera's, oh, like, what? um, in a crevice? That is, that is the, uh, Victoria T-Rex one. Oh, where they kind of bite each other's faces. Yeah, it's where Victoria is squaring up against a uh, male tyrannosaur. It, re it reminded me... It reminded me of, like, a battle between hippos. Yeah, well, neither of them want to get hurt, and they're both equally able to murder each other, so they want to be as careful as possible. So stepping around each other, showing off their strength, showing how intact they are, how strong they are, how oh, impressive they are... Before we move... There is a burrow here I need to kill. Oh, go ahead. But yeah, uh, I thought that was fascinating. So that they can avoid actually getting hurt. Okay, Ohio Frog, time to die. <sighs> Jesus Christ, when we bite, we have a crunch. Oh, yeah. Like, it actually sounds violent. Hi. What is it? What is, what's going on? What's wrong? Wings. Oh. Hi. Hello. Where are you? What are you? I'm in a bush, and what you're hearing is a hat. Oh, you son of a bitch. Ah! He, there's one right here! Be very, very careful. Please don't murder me.
He's standing over me! Yes, he is. What do I do? Hi. Oh, oh, I'm afraid. I am afraid. I am afraid. Oh my god, I am afraid. Run! Run! Oh. Run? Run. I'm running. Oh, oh, I need a cave! We need a cave! Please tell me there's a cave! Uh, you know, there is not. What do we do? What do we do? What do we do? We run, we run over here, and we get low. Oh! Oh, I'm very exposed. Keep going! To go! Oh! Shit! There's water. Oh god, we're trapped. I'm running past him! What are you doing? Oh my god, there's two of them. I know. What are you doing? I'm trying to get into it. Leave me alone. Oh, keep running! Eeh. Our stamina can outlast theirs, and as long as they lose sight of us for like 30 seconds, they can't keep uh, going after us. Okay, let's get the fuck out of here. We outing! Stop. Just keep running. I'm trying. <laughs> oh! Cave! Huh? No, it's not a cave. Oh, 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 there's little areas around here that have bloodstones that we can hide under. Okay, I'm coming. Oh, they oh, want our right. acids. Yep, there should be a thing over here. Yeah, yeah! <laughs> Fuck you! Fuck you guys! Haha! <laughs> Can't get us under here. Yeah, get fucked. Oh, that is so pathetic. Hey, one's flying away. Yeah, one is, but the other one is sticking around. No, I think he's taken off too. Did you get hit? Yeah, I did. How are you alive? I bit him. Ah, uh, so y'all tra traded. Yeah, let's get out of here. I don't want to collect it. Oh, we're, we're in Birchwood. Ah, oh, they chased us right where we wanted to be. They did. Yeah, we'll head this way. Uh, be very careful if we come across an adult Tyrannosaurus. Our best option is to run. You don't need to twist my arm. Oh, there's another burrow for me to kill. Watch my back. I will. Yeah, just watch out for those birds. That's what, I'm, that's what I'm afraid of. Uh, they have a timer of 15 minutes now because they uh, failed to hunt on us. Haha! <laughs> Losers! Yeah, because they failed to hunt, uh, they now have a 15 minute timer on hunting any other baby Tyrannosaurus. Okay. Ah! Go on. My kill. Go on. Mine. Just be careful getting close to the water. I don't have a choice, it's going right for it. Where'd it go? Oh, you son of a bitch. Come back here! Where'd it go? It ran along the water's edge. There it is. Come here. Come here, Ohio frog. Ow. Where? Aha! Come here! God damn you! Yeah, those little buggers are annoying. Get over here! Oh my god, how am I missing? I'm standing right above you! Thank you! Jesus Christ on a stick! Is that you running around? Yeah, that's me. Okay. Ain't no one here but us, my friend. Oh, don't say that. Some Allosaurus will run out now. Just pop up and stand up. Don't jinx us! Don't jinx that! <laughs> That's. I mean, quets. Does 
you want a piece of us? Yeah, he wants a piece of us. Do we kill him? Can we kill him? Oh, the slidey. Me no like the slidey. Where'd he go? Ah. Don't worry, I'm coming. Oh, I got stuck. Come meet your demise. Ah! Oh no, I'm gonna die. Sanctuary! No! Ah! I ran right into him. Help me, help me, help me, help me, help me, help me! Oh! Where do I go? Where's the hole? Get me in here! Why is it always the goddamn pterosaur? Ah! I died. Well, that was classic, wasn't it? Jesus Christ! Dude! <laughs> Look at you! Yeah. I know. Look at the stripes that are starting to come in. Yeah, oh my god. What the fuck? Yeah. The skin fade is actually really good with this animal. Uh, there's... Did you do that sneeze, or was that... Yeah, that's me. No. Okay. Just good. checking out the animations. Dude, uh, you, you straight up look like the Isle Tyrannosaurus in its old days. Oh, God. With, I, like, the pale I loved, body. I loved when that T-Rex came out. I do. I don't know. It kind of looks a lot like a pale elephant. No, not the uh, second iteration of the model. Uh, the oh, the original. Have, but when it first came out. No, oh, no, the T-Rex has had three models currently. Yeah, there's uh, there's the, um, the Stomping TSL. Lands version. The TSL, the original Isle model, and then we have the current model. Uh, Which looks awesome. And a couple others. The current model does look good, it's just too skinny. And, the, you know, the lips, really? the lacrimal horns. Yeah, they've shrink wrapped the head. I mean, yeah, obviously. But that's, that's just the oh, no. aesthetic they're going for. No, uh, they went with a somewhat Jurassic Park style, but while Jurassic Park didn't actually shrink wrap the head like a lot of people say it did, the Isle did. They are, like, skin to skull with their wrecks. Yeah, but at least their wrists aren't broken. Yeah, that's, that's a plus. <laughs> By the way, did you see that, there, that there's now a new dinosaur game coming out called Amber Isle? I did not. Think Animal Crossing. Exactly like Animal Crossing, but all the characters are prehistoric animals. Oh, I'm okay with that. I like playing Animal Crossing. It's relaxing. I thought it was meh. But honestly, I, I still think Paleo Pines is going to be my de facto. I still need to buy that. Yes, you do. It is a beautiful game. Tell me, have you uh, recently watched the Dinosauria and Soria series on YouTube? Obviously, yes. What did you make oh, of... My, oh, you know what? You know what's but... funny? You know what's funny? People keep telling me to react to Soria, and I tell them I would love to. But I can't. Because all of my Dinosauria series reaction videos have been copyright claimed. And I don't yeah. want to do that again. It's a pity because it is a very, very good series. Yeah, right? It's beautiful. Uh, David is an amazing person for him to create those. Like, fuck, if I could animate like that, oh my god. Imagine the stories I could tell with that. I've been trying to do small animations like that over the years. Never ended up catching on. So for my viewers, like, uh, if you wanted, to, if you want to, uh, would you like to divulge in like the creation process of the primordial Tyrannosaurus? Well, like most things that go through a creation process, you have to plan out the design. You have to plan out the abilities ahead of time. Uh, sometimes you get inspirations for new abilities later on, but honestly, most of the time, the base work is coding. Right. There's obviously animating, there's sound design. Uh, Primordial Tyrants has an amazing sound designer. I do believe that there's two now, but I can't quite remember. But 
the sheer amount of work that goes into it, every single creature that they make is staggering. The skins take months at times to make, the animations themselves take weeks or months too as well, depending on the quality of them or the intricacy of them. Uh, the T-Rex, Trot, and Run cycle have been through four variations. And uh, originally they had to unrelease the T-Rex when they first dropped it because some of the animations uh, were missing key parts, like the jiggle you see when you move. Yep. Uh, that was forgotten to be added in when they first released it, so they unreleased it again and uh, added it back in and then drop it again the next day. Uh, There's a lot of little things that uh, get added in, taken away and then uh, improved over time. It's a lot of, uh, you know, going back in and polishing things off. But I think the most intensive part has to be the coding and the animating. Yeah. The animating simply because if you get one thing wrong, you'll end up with uh, aisle esque animations where you see the leg just merge in with the body. Yeah, that or, is a bit weird. Or thighs breaking into calves or heads folding into chests. So when you do the animation, you have to see, you know, if it works properly, you know, biologically. Yeah, and you have to bind them to uh, every point and fixture on the body that's been sculpted as well, because if one thing goes wrong with the animation, uh, it can fold in on itself, and you can end up results with the results of uh, basically getting a skinny model with the animations. Uh, Path of Titans posted the video of their Dino Kairos. Oh yeah, I remember that. <laughs> that was similar to what happens there. That, that was cursed. I'm not well versed in 3D animation, but well, from what little I do know, it's always a blast whenever that happens. Right. Because you get to go through everything that, that you did wrong, and you have to work through every single one again, attaching every point of texture and every point of articulation. Which T-Rex specimens are, you know, for this? Because it's not like um, the, the previous T-Rex, where it's all the species. There are actually variants uh, to this Rex. So the base is Stan, Stocky is Sue, Slim I believe is, well I can't remember what one, what the Slim one is honestly, but the one with the large hornlets Which is me. Is Scotty. Yep, I, yeah, I chose the Scotty model. Scotty. I personally love the Scotty model. It is my favorite. I have always had a thing for horns on Tyrannosaurs. Yeah, it, it, it's cool. Kind of a shame that I mean, prehistoric planet. Their T Rex knocked it out of the park, but I wish the hornlets were a bit bigger. Absolutely, uh, with a lot of animals and their displays and how big keratin can grow of bone, we don't know for sure how big the keratin sheath would be over their brows or anything in particular. But from my assumption, I think that would probably be where you would see the most dimorphism between the two sexes. Wait, shh, you hear that? I just heard like a hiss. Oh, that's probably my footsteps on the grass. No, it's not. It was not. That was another baby Rex. Was it? Yes, it was. And that sounds like food to me. Do we? Do we kill it? Wait, hold on. That might not be a baby Rex. What could it be? Oh, 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 run, run. That, that's a Capro. Uh-oh. Do we really want to stay in Birchwood now that we know there's... Uh, well, we're going to move further into the forested area over here and hope that we can find something small that we can kill. I mean, we could, but I'm not really all that hungry. What about you? Oh, I'm last quarter. Oh my god, why haven't you eaten anything? Oh, I've been trying to. Well, food stuff should spawn on the map like when you get hungry enough, right? Uh, no, that doesn't happen. What? Gone, gone, gone. Not anymore. Uh, the corpses are in set locations now. Well, no, not, not corpses. Like, burrows and stuff will, like, pop up on the map. If you get, get down. Get down. Get well, down. Get down. That, that's a tall boat. No, that's a Giga. That, that, uh, that is a Giga. Big? No, sub it off. Yeah, I don't want to fuck with that. What? Whoa, what was that? That was a Giga of Lysings. So, clearly it's not, AI. it's not interested in us. Okay, let's move quietly up this way. Hopefully the Giga won't come after us. Hopefully. But considering it was eating AI, it's probably starving. Yeah, 
and I don't know how fast we can run in comparison. Uh, Gig is a little bit faster. Frankly, I don't want to find out. Gig is a little bit faster, and... I said, uh, frankly, I didn't want to find out. Fair enough. Sure, that's a smart way. idea. Yeah, let's just head this way, because it didn't go this way when left. If it comes after us, I'll break its leg and we can just sprint. Yes, please, because I, I can't defend myself. Whoa! I see it. Oh, God. We're fine. I spooked him. He's staring right at us. Yeah, he's staring, but he don't think he's gonna fall out. And if he does, I'll kill him. You you kill a sub adult Giga. Haha! <laughs> don't make me laugh! The only thing I'm really scared about is Mega Raptors, you know. Ah, yeah, those bloody things. Hey, I, there's a bar over here that I can kill. Oh, let me try fix. oh there's, I hear something moving around. What's that? I don't know. I have to be careful around the water, obviously. Huh, I didn't know Birchwoods came this far out. Yeah, uh, Burnt Forest is over there. Ooh, fun. You know, I it's really I really want to explore more of this map, because I always stick to a few places. Uh, we'll wander around. We can feed ourselves after all. And what better way to do it than a, than as a T-Rex, which is kind of like the globe trotter of the Cretaceous. For real. Also, did you hear about the um, the Tyrannosaurus Mick, uh, the, I mean, the new species that was found? The Mexican Tyrannosaurus. I have. Yes. <laughs> What are your thoughts on that? Do you think it's a bunch of bunk, or do you think it's actually I, legit? I think it is legit. It is very much, most likely, a relative of Tyrannosaurus Rex. Would you say it's a, a direct ancestor, or...? It probably is. Honestly, with how close in taxonomy it is, I would not be surprised if it is a direct ancestor to it. Or at least a direct ancestor to uh, other close relatives, like the Spletosaurus. Okay, come eat. How's your hunger? Uh, just, just over the bottom of the stomach, so I'm gonna have to find another burrow soon, or a player to murderize. Whoa! What was that? I have no idea. It sounded big. Well, I think it might be something that's eating plants. I think it might be something that's eating plants up top here. Hopefully it's something we can kill. Oh no, definitely not. What are you doing? Sprinting? Yeah, I don't... I don't... Oh wait, he's logged. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know don't if... Worry, they can't be as well right now. I don't think we want to fight an Montosaurus. I'm good. <laughs> no, those, those are one of the things I will never go after because they are mean. Yeah, let's um, let's not and say we did. There's something to our left, up on top. I don't see it. No, I can hear it up there. Sound big? Sounded roughly my side. Oh, there it is. That's what we were hearing. Oh, at least one of those things. What is it? The dryo. Well, we're not going to be able to kill that. Wait, that is that a dryo? No, that's not a dryo. That, that, that's, that's, uh, that's one of those Mega Raptors, the newer ones. Shit, but what do we do? It's not really a threat to me, but to you? Yeah, uh, if it uh, comes close, I'll break its leg and we'll just, we'll mob it. Right. Oh, something's, something's getting attacked over here. You think we can contest the body? Oh, absolutely. Oh, what is that? Oh, uh... It's a para being attacked by the little buggers. We can just sit and watch this, right? I'm not sure if you want to attack an entire pack of those guys. No, but we can contest the body. Uh, the entire pack of them, though? I don't think even we can take on an entire pack. Well, won't they just... Well, won't they bugger off? If no, we contest... if, we can... if we contest, we have to fight them. 
What? I thought people, like... Okay, that's weird. I thought, like, um, it was universal for, like, you know, you could either fight or give it up. Yeah, but there's an entire pack of them. Yeah, I see what you mean now. Well, yeah, there's one, two, three, four of them. And there's something moving up behind us, too. But well, it's further away. Well, what's the point of us watching, then? Because I'm going to snag a bit of meat from behind this parrot. I'm going to take a little bit of that. Thank you. Yeah, they will <laughs> mind us if we snag a piece, but probably sitting down to eat would get us killed. Come on. Let's, let's get out of here before... Before they decide to go for us. Look at the size of your fucking head! <laughs> Jesus Christ on a stick! Yeah, it's something. And it's hiding in a bush, so that makes it even more menacing. I am subadult now. About time. A subadult is the longest growth stage, if I remember rightly. I mean, any T-Rex in any game is a proper investment. It doesn't matter. Oh, absolutely. Because it's guy, the dinosaur it's a, everyone oh, wants. Oh, oh, the, uh, other way. Is there another way? Over here? Hold on, I'm just going to look over the edge see if there's a way I can drop. Do you want to drop when you're this big? I don't think you do. I'ma test it. As Urban, don't go over the edge. Urban, no. Urban, no. Noni. I'm good. I'm a mountain goat. Hell yeah. You. You mad lad. Ow. <laughs> How come I got hurt? Interrupt. Haha. Uh -huh. I still made it down anyway. Oh, there's bones here, but we're not gonna be able yeah. to eat them. Yeah, I'm collecting them so I can have my little quest rewards so I can afford the scavenger thing. Just so I can fill up. You're proving him right. Nah, T-Rex yep. is an opportunist. We all yep. know that. Same as any other carnival that exists. Yeah. Jack Horner is a piece of work. Yeah. Real boy called Batman. Yeah, we- he's like Bruno from Encanto. We don't talk about him. Yeah, but Bruno was actually a good person. Can I? Yes, I can. Can what? Confirm! I have scavenger! Yay! Then I can eat this! Absolutely. Now go Where eat the- Where are my bones? <laughs> Where are my bones? I'll tell you what, as a as an adolescent, I don't look that bad. So yeah. I'm guessing I can't get metabolism until I'm a bit bigger. Uh, metabolisms are in subadults. Fuck. And your hunger? How's that doing? Uh, it just got to the bottom of the stomach, so once I find more bones, I'm going to be chowing down on those. We've got company. Oh, God. It's something small. Uh. Hold we... on. Let's find out what it is. We could probably take it. I think it's an Amaga. Wait, it's over here! What is it? It's a theropod. It's a Cryolophosaurus. Oh! Where are you? I'm right here. What are you doing? I'm looking at the cryo. I don't know how buff a cryo is, so I'm curious about how many were there. I only saw the one, but I don't know if no, there's three. Uh, three. I don't know if we want to fight that. One, two, three, four. Yeah, I'm good. And they're making their way up towards us. Ooh, they're wanting to go, don't they? Yeah. It... Up on the rock, if you can. I'm trying. And not in for me. I'm trying. Oh god. Yep, here they come. You you might want to back up. If you get bit by me, it's over. I'm trying. I can't tell what call is that is. Is he being threatening or friendly? That's a one call. 
Oh, here they come. Here they come. Get ready. Behind you. Yeah, I see him. I don't like how he got closer. There's one coming up behind you. I know. This is why I got faster. Uh, Urban! Urban, help! Turn around and get them. Oh, shit! Oh, gripe! Oh, fight, 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 fight. Get back up to the corner. It was at this moment that he knew. I bone broke one. The albino, get him. He's dead. Yes, we got one. Yes, yes. We did it. We did it! Oh my god! Yes! Yes! Fuck you! <laughs> Fuck you! Well done for that bone break, man. Oh, that was beautiful! I have never won a fight in my life. That was awesome. <laughs> I finally won a fight as a T-Rex. <laughs> and we're full, right? I am mostly full, yes. There's a burrow right behind me if you want to top off. Nah, we're gonna leave this area now. Yep, let's go. Uh, let's head north. Oh my god, that was the most epic fight of my life. <laughs> you got that bone break off on him and I zeroed in and I was just like, Alright, you gotta learn today. <laughs> oh, the teamwork, the teamwork. How's your health, by the way? Oh, you're good. Yeah, you I only got bit man. once. Amazingly. Yeah, don't fuck with us. Yeah, Rex is... Rex is fun. Yeah, slay! <laughs> oh man, I've never been so happy to make a kill in my life. <laughs> Turtle shell. Hey, it's just like Prehistoric Planet. Oh man, my palms are still shaking from that fight. <laughs> it always is fun, getting that little acceleration from a hunt. To be fair, we shouldn't have won that fight. There, it was five against two. No, we won that fair and square. They're close to our size, but we're in a totally different weight class. Yeah, we are completely in a different league. They were using their ability calls, which, you know, helps, but... It didn't really help them in the end, now did it? No, getting off a bone break on something that's in a smaller weight class, and you You're done. give them a death sentence. Yep. Oh, man. Oh man, I can't believe that that bone brick was so well timed. It was, and then I just sprinted after the poor little bugger. I mean, I just kind of panicked a little bit. Uh, I had one almost at death's door already because he didn't run away fast enough, but uh, because he got that white one, yeah, it was already over. That was an interesting sound. What was that? I think that might have been one of the Mega Raptors or one of the Cryos. If it was one of the cryos, we'll they should know better than to mess with us. Yeah, we'll find out here shortly. Yeah, it sounds like they're fighting another Rex. Well, that's not our fight. Maybe? I'm not sure. No, it's a... You? It's a cryo fighting something else. Where? I can't see it. Over there on the other side. Look where I'm facing. Over yeah, there. Yeah, that's where I'm looking. Yeah, that's where I'm looking. Oh. oh, you don't have that render range then. No, I see them per fight. It looks like feathers, actually. Maybe a ute? Yeah, it might be a cryo. Maybe a ute? No, it's not. It's no, not no, like a ute. some cryos attacking a ute? No. Uh, the utes, you would hear it. No, we'll circle around and see what fun they're having. How much coin do I have right now? 1,500. Do I need any more abilities? I do. I want to pick up Tyrant's Roar real quick. Oh, yeah. Tyrant's Roar would be a godsend. I have a question. If Primordial Tyrants has, like, these good models, couldn't they themselves make a game? Oh, absolutely. Like, just, just a thought, but I'm like, with these models, like, 
It seems like a waste if you didn't do it. Yeah, it's expensive. That's all I gotta say. Hello? Oh, there's a cryo down there. I know. Or, or is it? That looks more like a dilo, actually. No, these are cryos. These are they the same ones from before? Off. Yeah. Are they? Yeah, it does the yep. exact same. <laughs> we ran into them again! Oh, that was a baby Rex that just ran past me. That's cute. Do we let him live? Yeah. Yeah, we'll let him live. I'm not that hungry. I'm a bar and a half away from being an adult at this point. Are you serious? I'm serious. No shot. No, I'm serious. I'm a bar away from being a sub adult. <laughs> It's alright, you can still group with me, even though- I know! Adult. Like, I know that we can pair up, like, at least, but we can't have any more than two. Yeah. At least until next nesting comes, because I'm sure there'll be exceptions to that. I'm treating this as a, uh, brother pair. Like, with lions and whatnot. Ah. Uh, or the two from Prehistoric Planet. Now we just need a herd of a, a very stupid Edmontosaurus. <laughs> but to be fair, I don't blame uh, the Edmontosaurus for running away, because there were two T-Rex that time. And they Running were away from the and they were T-Rexes makes sense. And they were spooked, so yeah. I get it. Running away, run away from even one makes more sense because yeah, they're just as big as a T-Rex, but why would they want to run the risk? Is the question when they're faster? Because they can defend themselves. So can water buffaloes against lions, but they still run if they can, and unless they know they have the advantage, they don't stick around. Eh, fair enough. I, I mean, I just like to see one documentary, in modern times anyway, where a hadrosaur can defend itself against a tyrannosaurus. Oh, this coming from this coming from a guy whose whole world revolves around T-Rex. I would love the an Edmontosaur headbutt the jaw of a tyrannosaur and knock loose a bunch of teeth. Oh yeah, I would only... love to see yeah. that. And then the, the tyrannosaur gets spooked and then bugger off. As much as I adore Tyrannosaurus, as much as it is my favorite thing to ever exist. It's powerful, it. but it's not invincible. Exactly. It is a Apex Predator. It is the Apex Predator. But for all intents and purposes, it is not untouchable. Yeah. It I mean, Prehistoric well, Planet Season 2 made that very clear. Oh, absolutely. With the fight with the Quetzalcoatl, it's like... Yeah, the T-Rex stood its ground for a little bit, but when two Quets came around, it, yeah, it buggered off and decided, you know what, it's not worth it, I'll just come back later. Should I get the red herring ability now, or wait? Uh, it's expensive. I can still get it, though. Yeah, I get it. Like, see how fast I am currently? Yeah, of course. Give me a second. Yeah, I'm sold. Just make sure nothing kills me while I'm doing this. Oh, you got your crimson skin coming through now? Yeah, look at me. Oh, let me sit down just here. Let's have a look at you. Oh, yeah. It is starting to come through, especially on the face. Give me just a sec. I see you. <laughs> Hold on. There's what? another Rex over there. How big? Eh, it sounds like a sub adult over there. We could kill it! Are you hungry? Are you? I've got a little bit. But I'm okay for now. Yeah, I mean, not every episode has to be jam-packed with action. And also, I don't want to get in trouble with the admins if I don't have to. But if he starts something, oh, oh that's a that, that that's an acro. That's an acro. That is. And he's coming. An and he's coming across the water. What? I don't see him. I just saw him over oh. there. I see him. What do we do? Oh, I'm gonna fight this bastard. Are you sure? Oh yeah. He's a young one, and I can absolutely fuck him up. You sure you want to fight this fight? It's not an adult acro. Again, are you sure? Because once I we do this, once we up. do this, we gotta commit. Oh, I'm doing it. Oh, is he running away? Yeah, he is. I'm almost a fully grown adult. So... Oh my god, he's actually scared of us.
Now that he's seen, now he's seen there's two of us. Turn around, you bugger. Ah! Oh, he's leading to exactly where I wanted to take us anyway. Is he? Yeah. Over there is uh, Savannah. Ah. Yeah, you oh. can roar. You can roar. But you're just leading us right to you. He is sprinting for his life. Also, there's something to our left. Yeah, I hear it. He's circled around. Well, what's he? What's he gonna do, right? I'm out in the open. I'll see if I can lure him. It's something else. Oh, what was that? It's a baby Rex. Oh, hello. Okay. Nah, I, I don't want to be evil. I don't want to be evil. I'll let him live for now. But I'll let him know that I'm not his friend. Think that scared him off? Most likely. Oh, look at all these fireflies. I'd like to make myself believe. You see that thing over there? What Run. thing? The baby. Go get it. <laughs> I don't want to be evil, though. I know how hard it is to be a wretch. It's also just a hatchling. Fair. We kind of be doing it a mercy, actually. We would. Where's the little bugger? He's over there. I'm looking directly in this direction. This way? Gone. You savage motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> well, he should be a juvenile now if he was just a hatchling. Yep. I'm so sorry, little one, if you're watching this, but we had to do it. He's hungry. But Jesus Christ, he has so much meat on him. I was at a quarter and now I'm full. What was this little guy made out of? Meat. Yeah, clearly. You know what's sadder about that kill? Is that, he, is that he squeaked. That's what made it sad oh. for me. He squeaked. I don't like killing things that squeak. Acro. Acro's here. I must be blind because I do not see where he is. He's right by those trees where I'm looking. You see him right there? You want to fight this fight? Oh, I absolutely will. Well, we're definitely letting him know we mean business. Yeah, he's trying to fast log or switch up the ability. Well, hopefully he doesn't take the coward, cowardly route. Uh, he's switching his ability to stay back. Right, I'm staying back. No, that's not an acro, that's no, a car car. That's a car car. <laughs> Do we have any chance of killing it? Oh, absolutely. We can mess up a car car. How are we going to go about this? Should I give you the tyrant's roar? Do you have it? Yes. Use it. Get him! John, you bastard. Can't try and get his uh, phone break. Trying to get close enough for a bomb break. Damn it, I missed. I'm about to run out of stam. I hit him, but I didn't break him. Yeah, it's because it's his tail. Damn yeah, it, I missed again. Me. Huh? Throw him back towards me if you can. Come on, you bastard. He's circling around. Yeah, I know, I'm coming to him. Nah, he'll mess you up with that tail hit. He does more damage with that than... Uh, bone break on... No, you didn't. No, no, I said for you to do it. I can't. I don't have enough stamina to do it. Come on. Come on, you bugger. Come on, you, you bastard. Missed. Damn it, I try to get him on the turn. Yeah, he shouldn't be using his tail offensively. Oh, my heart's racing. Giving you Tyrant's Roar again? Thank you. That's right, you little bitch. Come on.
Come on. Flinch up. That's right. That's all right, body shot that time. See if you can get a bone break on him, you've got some stamina back now. Yep, yep. Oh, damn it! He lunged right at me, I couldn't predict his move. Okay. I'm gonna try to bait him again. Move. It's coming for you. I forget about precise turn. Uh, run in and see if you can get a bone break. Don't go to his tail, try and aim for his side. And if he turns around to bite you, run back towards me. Alright, I'll try. Uh, break to his right. Alright, hold on, I got an idea. I'm gonna see if I can bait him to me by standing still. You just make sure that'll be you'll ready. Die. You'll die! Ow. Oh, sorry. He must be low, right? Oh, yeah, absolutely. He's at death. Either that or he's a half. Oh, he's coming to me. He's coming to me. He's trying to. Thank you. Yep. Don't get in the way. I got him! Go get him! Okay. I can't, I don't have stand. And he's Yeah! Dead. Yeah! All right. Once yeah. again, I come in clutch. Absolutely. bloody Oh that's my keep... god, that was awesome. And that's why you keep a Teen Rex with you. The bloody fast. Tell you what though, he almost got me. Oh, absolutely. Man, that was fucking awesome! Yes, it was. We actually won a fight against another Apex. Mm -hmm. Granted, it was 2v1, it was kind of unfair, but still we won. Yeah, he was a late sub too. And he, d he put up a good fight though, he did put up a good fight. He did. He did but really well. He did awesome! You see, I recognize when it's a good fight. If you're just killing just to be an asshole, that's not a good fight, that's just you being a dick. Oh my god, I have had more victories playing with you than anyone else. <laughs> I play this game a lot. Yeah, it shows. All I right. will say, if someone does come to contest the body, I say let him have it. I don't care if it's the smallest thing, I'll let them have it. Alright, you go ahead and eat up if you need to. Oh, I'm good. It's just thirst that I'm worried about. Don't worry, you'll be good on water for a while. We're just going to go there once this body despawns. I thought it would have lasted a bit longer than that. Like until nah, we, we, like until we finished it or until it reached 0%. Nah, we took it down to uh, So it despawned quicker. Go on, wow. we'll head over this way and we'll get some water from the big lake. You should have some nice face scars after getting smacked in the face with that tail so many times. Uh, I don't oh, see it. Hell? I just got, I got blood from when I ate him. Nah, I've got a small one, and I've got some pl plenty of scars around my thighs from that Hatsocopteryx. But hey, cranial facial scars, that's kind of like an important feature of T-Rex. And I'm assuming by now you're an adult. Oh yeah, I've been an adult for a while now. Yeah! I'll All right. just try to put my last thing in. Senses confirmed ambush. There we go. Those. And I'm good. My build is set. I do more damage on the first attack now. Awesome. And we both have Tyrant's Rule, so it stacks the damage. And we also have Bone Break. Yeah, also, and, did you uh, ever use Titan's, Tyrant's Roar, or was that all me? I did. I used it the first time. Oh, so every other time then, it was me. Yeah, because my stamina was too low to use it. Uh, oh, it costs stamina to use it. Yeah, that's why you got to be very careful. Tell you what, I've explored a lot more of this map than I typically do. <laughs> Yeah, as a Rex, you go to Wanda. You can set up a territory if you want, but you have to have a specific place, like Birchwood, Burnt Forest, or uh, Savannah. But places for ambushes are the best places, so Birchwood and Burnt Forest. Right. Or places in the deserts where you can blend in with a lot of the uh, brown skins that T-Rex has. Or if you want action, go to Grand Plains. Oh, dear God. Yeah, that's right over there. Oh, God, I didn't even think of that. 
Yeah, I don't feel yeah. that confident just yet, because I know that's where all the groups are going to be. Yeah, once we're both adults, we could check it out, but as of right now, no. I want to make sure that you're fully grown before we do that. Alright, time to drink. Even though this water is clearly poisonous. <laughs> Lots of sulfur. Very stinky. We've almost fully recovered from that fight with the car car. Mm hmm. Oh, man, I can't get over that name. Car car. <laughs> I will always think of the gaming beaver in his story of trying to get the Mattel car car down the source. Oh, God. Classic. I do hear something running. Yeah, it's over here. Unless it means something heavier, which I don't hear that. Hold on. Oh, it is something heavy. It's a big one. I hear it, it's down there. Let's go find out what it is. You never know. <laughs> but whatever it was, it just gave itself away. Cryo. Again? Yeah, he doesn't yeah. want to mess with us. He doesn't want to catch these hands. He doesn't want this. He doesn't want this heat. Because he knows if he throws hands at us, he's going to die. Oh yeah, it's just a single cryo. Although the thing that was big is still down here. That little bugger ain't worth it. No, but he's being loud and obnoxious. Is he seriously trying to challenge us? No. He can't hold territory. Oh, hello, car car. Is it the same one? It can't be. No. You know what? We'll let this one go. But if he starts throwing hands at us, we'll show oh, him no, what no. happened to no, the no. last guy. Yeah, there's not many things I'll take on two Tyrannosaurus. One? Maybe. But two? Definitely not. Yum, 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 yum. Juicy! I am only two bars away from adulthood. Hell yeah. I feel... Just as the as Skillet would say, invincible. <laughs> yeah, I love Skillet. I absolutely love their music. I've actually listened to them more than any other artist this year. Spotify mi told me. Oh, what did I listen to this year? I listened to Epic the Musical. I've had a thing about uh, that one song, Ruthlessness. The other thing I've listened to most is Loser Baby. Oh, absolutely. I uh, I will replay that shit over and over and over again because I love Keith David's voice that much. That, that and Hell's Greatest Dad. I love that I song. I will forever hate Mimsy for butting in on that song. Absolutely. Like, and, and, and I'm not the only one. I'm not the only one, apparently. Apparently, everyone, almost everyone hates Mimsy just for that. Don't, don't get me wrong. I absolutely adore the voice actress. Yeah, me too. That plays Mimsy because uh, she plays Spinel in the Steven Universe movie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. God damn, did they ruin the best part of the song? That, that 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 felt like a slap to the face. And ever since then, Mimsy has always had that rep of like, I fucking hate you. <laughs> did you ever listen to the uh, extra song that was made for Hell of a Boss of Stola singing uh, "Look My Way"? Yes, I've and I cried. That, that I cried Solus, so perfect. hard. Dude, the best part of that animation is when Solus leaps to the moon oh, the and there's yes. water. That that looks so clean. There's also that uh, one scene of him and the moon being constellations. Yeah, and then you see Blitz all curled up. Mm -hmm. That that the, the way that they turn it to still keep it 2D is a really it's good thing. It's beautiful. Bit of you see, this is why I think animation like 2d animation is such an underrated art form especially during this time when you know ai is kind of taking over and you know uh 3d animation and live action remakes are kind of a heavy thing nowadays like 2d is just kind of a dying art form these days yeah. 2d animation is something that needs to be uh you know oh god what's the word respected more often it's a medium that just isn't used as much and it needs to be because the amount of things you can get done with it is staggering. You know what's a uh, film worth praise for its animation? Mm -hmm. Who Framed Roger Rabbit? Oh god, yeah. People have busted their backs to make that movie. Yeah, the blending of animation styles and CG and practical effects is... It's incredible. Like, 
I don't think anyone in our in this generation or the ones that will come after will appreciate the lengths that the artists and the filmers had to go through to make the illusion of like cartoon characters in the real world. Is that a Edmonto ahead of us? I think there is. I can't tell. And frankly, I'm not gonna fight it to find out. Yeah, Edmonto's on something that I really want to fight. I mean, even if there is two of us, I don't really want to chance it. No, that's entirely fair. So, we'll let this guy go. For now. Like, the only way I would ever, ever fight an Montosaurus is if I was desperately hungry. Mm -hmm. There are two of us, to be fair. And we could take it down. But yeah, I'd rather take it down while it's distracted, asleep. Or yeah, if it's asleep, if it's asleep, I'll take a cheap shot at it. I'll, I'll take a cheap shot. But when it's conscious and fully focused on its surroundings, yeah, I'm good. I don't want to be stomped into a pancake. Car, car. Is it the car, same car. guy? It's the same guy from before. That doesn't sound like a car car, though. No. That's an Amargosaur. Oh, there is an Amargosaur down there. Should we? Are you hungry? No, but I want to have some fun. I don't want you to lose health around a car car. I mean, fair, yeah. But still, it's in a marg. Are you hungry, though, is the question. Nah, I'm not that hungry. Nah, any worth it, then. Damn, you know what? If I was a little bit hungrier, yeah. But if that car car goes for us, I'm throwing hands. You oh, can that car bet car your goes ass. We could just tear him apart. I think it's trying to go for the car. Uh, a a marg? Marg, but the Wait, but you can't mix her, can you? You can, I believe. Really? Herbivores are pretty chill. Okay. Unless it's competing over a food source or a, uh, unless there's like a mating display going on at that point, males will get really rowdy. Yee! All right, how's your growth come along? I am halfway through the second to last bar. Good. You're starting to catch up on the chunk that I have. Yep, I'm starting to get the heft. Biggest threat to us is Gigas and two other Rexes. Yeah, that's a fight I would rather avoid. Oh, there's something coming down the path. I can hear it. Should we hide in the bush and wait? Nah, we're gonna cross over here and we're gonna go into Grand Plains. Are we? Yep. We're gonna uh, be forced to go. I don't know if I want to do that. Oh, okay. Like, I I feel more confident if I was fully grown. Alright. In that case, we'll wander the outskirts around here for a little bit. And then we'll circle around into Grand Plains once we've done grown, which will probably be in about 15 to 20 minutes at most, depending on your quest times. We might have to continue this, continue this another time. That's quite okay. So I think what we'll wait. do is... Um, Make it a two parts or something? We'll wait until I become fully grown. Mm -hmm. And then um, if we can find something like to fight within a short amount of time, I'll be down for that. But then after that, I have to go. Okay. Because my back is going through hell. No, I get it. Trust me, I understand. Uh, yeah. Being tall is not easy on the joints. It's not even just being tall. It's just that I'm leaning forward all the time. It's not a very good posture. Hey. What is it? Aquilos. And I think they want to go. Nah, they're clearing off. Yeah, yeah. You don't want to catch this. Although saying that, we don't have anything to keep them from pouncing on us, so... Oh, you hear that? What was that? Packy, I think. Oh, paleo paleontologically, we would be able to hunt them. Oh, absolutely. Also, yeah, I just now noticed we're in Grand Plains. Oh, shit. That's okay, we'll stick to the outskirts. You're almost fully grown. Yeah, I'm, I'm less than a bar away from full size at this point. It sounds like the Packy's actually getting attacked. Actually, I'm not sure if that is a Packy. No, that actually now that you say it, it doesn't sound it's like an aloe. It's an aloe. Interesting. And a camto? I'm not Camp sure if that's a camto. What is that? It is a camto. It's a camto, a kilo, and an aloe down there. Should they be fighting? It like, should there be a third party? Uh, no. The aloe is getting attacked by something else down by the beach, but this guy, they're running each other's fade right here. Look at them. We it's could. a little purple camto. We could contest oh. this. 
I'm gonna watch this. They both look like they're almost gone. I'm impressed by this Kanto right now. Oh my god, he did it! Alright, should we contest the body? You can have it if you want. Yeah, bugger off. He's just, let him keep the trophy. Yeah, he can have that. But I'm taking this. Oh my god, is he giving you... <gasps> he gave you the feather! That was nice of him. Oh, and the Kellen Ken's now going for him. <laughs> well, Hold on again. that the tables turned real quick on that, didn't it? Hey, look over there. Is that a Nozuto? It's a Nozuto. Where? Oh, yeah. Now I see it. Look at that. That's cool. Here we go. All right. But where to? No idea. We can go wander around if you'd like. Hey, yeah, I mean... there's a ferry over there. But I just oh, ate. Oh. We ha we don't really have a need to fight. Nope, but we do need water. I'm down half. Yeah, me too. Where should we go? Uh, we could go to that area over there. Yeah, I was about to say, if you say Impact Crater, I was, I was going to say you're out of your goddamn mind. Hey, look. That Metrodon. Ah, you were afraid of those for a minute. Hell yeah, they're nasty little blighters. Oh, there's a Kalenken coming right for him. Look at that. Yeah, there's also a Kentro. Yep, there you go. <laughs> I knew it. But now that we're here, we basically put a big target on our backs. Nah. Two Rexes, not many things will tango with us. Except two Gigas. Oh, so we got two Gigas. That's one way to go out, I will say that. Look, two, three of those. That'd be fun. Yeah, it would be. But we'd probably, oh, okay. we'd probably mess them up. Oh, absolutely. We head up this path in the mountains up here to the uh, pond, and then we'll head back down because you should be an adult by then. So, so far, how do you feel about the Rex? Absolutely love it. It's definitely a step above the base one, isn't it? Yes. And this just puts the Path of Titans dead teams to shame. Like, they've done God's work, but their T-Rex is gobshite in comparison to this. Absolutely. Uh, a lot of the more recent creatures really have just fallen downhill in quality compared to some of their older stuff. I have a little bit. Like, the Lambiosaurus TLC looks cool, but it's a, oh, but it's absolutely. too little too late. Absolutely. If they gave the Rex a TLC, I'd be happy. If they gave an Aloe a TLC. I'd they gave happy. an Aloe TLC already. Ecstatic. I would be ecstatic. Give Das a TLC. That got a TLC too. No, it needs a proper one. Yeah. Like, Lambio has gotten. <laughs> oh! A hair got in my mouth. <laughs> Alright, here's that little pond that I was on about. Awesome. And drink. Guess who just hit adult? Alright, let's go find ourselves something fun to fight. And so, the two adult tyrannosaurs emerged into Grand Plains once more, looking for a worthy opponent to fight for their epic final showdown. That, but it, David Attenborough. He has such, such a noteworthy voice. It's like, um... It's like oh, candy. God. It's like ear candy. Have, have you ever seen Dragonheart? Yes, Sean Connery. Yes. Thank you. I could not remember his name for the life of me. Sean Connery, uh, David Attenborough, uh, and Morgan. a couple others just have the perfect Morgan voices. Freeman. I don't think Morgan Actually, Freeman no, no, Morgan, Fre Morgan Freeman lately hasn't been doing too well. Hey, look, it's a Lambio. Should we? A uh, Lambio can outrun us. Damn. You hear that, Lambio? Just because you're faster, you got lucky. Look at Plus, my skin. I'm so evil looking. <laughs> like, don't fuck with this thing. I look like an old man. Yeah, might want to change that up if you, if you don't want to look old. Nah, I like the grizzled look. We got something ahead of us. I'm not sure if it's just a quest or something flying, but I hear it's a hat as well. Oh, uh, I, I still feel bitter about our last encounter with them. Oh, it's trying to go for the Lambio. Ah! You know what? What? If he gets low enough and crashes to the ground, I'm gonna bone break him. Wait, but can we third party? I'm pretty sure we can contest for a hunt. Oh, he just got whacked, immediately regretted his choices. 
What's the Lambio doing? It's getting into a corner where he can't really attack him properly. Yeah, that tail slap hurts like a motherfucker. Yeah, I don't doubt that. I like how we're just scouring the place looking for kills. Oh, there's something over there. What are those? Up where? They're making a beeline for us, it looks like. Carnos, I think. No, it's all those. No, Carnos. Hello. Do they want to catch these hands? No. Three Carnos, two T-Rexes. It's not a fun game for them. Go on, land, buddy. Don't, no, 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 on the tree. No. Land down here. You coward. Yeah, even the Lambio's like, fuck you. That Lambio did well enough. I, I ain't it, going after him. I'm gonna yeah. let him celebrate. Yeah, let him have this win. If we went after him right after that, I'd feel bad. To be perfectly honest. I see a car now. Oh, it's those three cars from before. Up there on the rock. I see him. Oh, hello. What is it's it? It's a Rex. All by itself? Yep. Our deadliest hunt. Sh nah, he's afraid. He doesn't want to catch this. What did he bring down? Was it another Rex? Whatever it is, it's huge. I think it's another Rex. Is it? Oh my. Another Rex. Oh my god. He actually did. Oh, the, the, the fucking Carnos are going after that poor Lambio. I see him. <laughs> Hey! That little ramp just right. stole a bit of meat! <laughs> it's alright. Oh, oh, they're getting involved in this. Oh, I gotta see this. I don't wanna fight, I just wanna watch. Same. The trikes aren't doing anything, though. Oh no, they're watching. Dinner and the show, I guess. Ah, uh, the Lambio died. Oh no! That wasn't cool! That wasn't cool! He just got from a fight! Uh, let's... let's find a place to sit down at least. Yeah, away from all this. I don't want to log in and immediately have to... Excuse nope. you? Excuse you? You really want to catch these hands? Go scream at me? This bird is staring down the face of death. <laughs> yeah, you want to catch his hands, buddy. Yeah, that's right. I didn't think so. <laughs> well, where do you think is an ideal spot for us to lay down? Uh, there's a little plateau over here that has a small cave right behind it. We could probably go there and log off. Yeah, it's right here. Yeah. Making our presence known so nothing fucks with us. We've got a couple of kills under our belt, see. Yeah. Wait, no, what's that one mobster voice? Shay! <laughs> Don't wanna throw hands with a Shay! Who is that voice actor? I have no idea. You sure sleeping out here in the open is okay? Yeah, by right here, we're totally fine. And the time to log out isn't that long. It's only 30 seconds. Oh, sweet! Oh. That's actually awesome. All right, we did it, guys. We got an adult Tyrannosaurus Rex in a community server. Bet you didn't see that coming. So obviously, we will be continuing this another day. Uh, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed this mega episode of, you know, Path of Titans 2000 subscribers special. Thank you, Urban Moon, for showing me the ropes in community servers yeah. and also just being a badass in general. You are quite welcome. But yeah, that, this is where we're going to end it. This was incredible. I have never won this many fights before in my life. Oh, I'm going to have a fun time editing. But yes, we did it. We finally became an adult Rex. My ass hurts. I'm going to end the video here. If you enjoyed it, leave a like, subscribe today, hit that notification bell so you don't miss anything new. All my links are in the link tree in the description down below. And until next time, this is Tyrano Senpai signing off. All right, then. Take care now. Bye-bye, then.